I tell people it's beyond the exercise, breathing techniques. It's beyond that, my friend. If you are in yoga, you are yoking yourself with demons. Glory to God. It's more than an exercise, my friend. It's a call yoking of together. You don't know what you're saying. You're speaking, you're chanting tongues that you don't understand. What breathing have to do with tongue, tongue talking? If you are a yoga, if you are in yoga, you are yoking yourself with demons. You are saying things that you don't even understand or comprehend. Hallelujah. Hinduism and Buddhism have crept in the church. Let me say it again. Buddhism and Hinduism have crept in the church. It's not about a breathing exercise. It's about chandelier. It's about yoking of the third eye. Hey, glory to God. Hinduism has crept in unaware because people are ignorant about the masses of you having a mat, being a genie in a bottle. Hallelujah and saying words. You ought to have the Bible. You ought to be carrying the Bible under your armpit, not a mat. Come on, sing some God. Wake up and realize you are chanting to demons. You are letting demons into your world. Hey, glory to God. How you listen to me? If you don't listen to me, you're going you gonna to suffer the consequences of getting demons into your house. How can you be a Christian? How can a church be a Christian church and having yoga exercise after church? Ah, oh, the devil is so slick. He's a smooth operator and he's fooling the masses of people in the church. You are so much into hallelujah yoga exercise. You forgot to read your Bible. You are so much into, into yoga exercise, you forgot to pray. You so much into yoga exercise, you forgot to fast. My friend, you are open your world to channeling demonic forces in your life. I must say this, my friend. There's a lot of churches ha, are, 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 are the doorway to hell because you letting these Hinduism come in. The church now become veganist. Veganist, you don't eat meat no more because meat is bad. The Bible say, what's in the chandelier? What's in the marketplace? Eat without asking question. The Bible say, in the last days, Pearl's time shall come, forbidden to marry and forbidden to eat meat. I'm talking about Hinduism and Buddhism. A big bald head man, hallelujah, in your pocketbook on your desk you praying to buddha buddha can't bless you only person can bless you is jesus christ when man bless you man can take away their blessing but when god bless you can no devil in hell take back your blessing the bible said blessing don't make you rich and have no sorrow to it so hinduism have crept in to our churches and if you are hinduist if you are buddhist and you're christian you are not a Christian, you are Buddhist and a Hinduist because you're doing yoga exercise and crept in our church. It's more than breathing. It's more than you getting in a stance, folding your, your legs together and hum. It's more than that, my friend. You are channeling demons into your life, channeling demons into your life.